Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Rinal Hazi as a group leader. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Shadil bin Rozan. Yeah. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Ilan Rizmani. Assalamualaikum. My name is Iskandar Zikanan bin Osman. Today, we will talk about Sedegan. And next, I will show you about Sedegan next. As you can see, there is 14 states in the Sedegan. Next. Okay, now I will talk about background of the country. Senegal is a country in West Africa. It is bordered by Mauritania in North, Mali at the East, and Guinea to the South East. Senegal also shares a maritime border with Cape Verde. Senegal is a low lying country, a country with semi desert area in North, North East, and in the South East. The capital of Senegal is Dakar. Dakar is the western port point in Africa. Senegal is slightly smaller than South Dakota. Senegal economic and political capital is in Dakar. Senegal is a semi-presidential, democratic republic and the politi political system remains dominated by the office of the presidency. Senegal has a mixed labor system called Juniper system which is based on, based on the French Civil Code and Senegalese Islamic Law, Senegal Central Bank called Central Bank of West African State. For the vast majority, for the vast majority of Senegalese, life is still a struggle and though tough there's feelings that the current government has failed its people. There seem few real alternatives. Despite well effort in stabilizing the economy, and his successful appeasement of the customers of the payment through a 2004 peace deal, most people's life, lives haven't particularly improved. With controversial decision to arrest former Prime Minister Idris Sex in 2005 on accusation of undermining state country state security funds sends the country into a political debate. The Casamat is an ongoing low-level conflict that has been waged between the government of Senegal and the movement of democratic force of Casamat since 1982. On May 1, 2014, the leader of the FFDC stood for peace and declared a unilateral Casamat. In February 2006, the former Indian Indonesia Sec was released and all charges were dropped. But the political debate has remained hit ever since. For the vast majority of Senegalese, life is still a struggle and though just feeling that the current government has fed its people. Okay, next is the population of the Senegal from 2010 until 2019. Based on the latest United Nations estimates, the current population of Senegal is 16,630 and 855. Senegal population is equivalent to 0.22% of the total world population. The total land area is 192,530 km. Senegal ranks number 71 in the list of the uh, country's population. As we can see, the population has increased from 2009 until 2017. From 2009 until 2010, the population has increased from 12.55 until 12.92. Okay, next from 2011, from 13.3 to 13.7. Next, from 2013 to 2014, the population has increased from 14.12 to 14.55. To 2015. And until 2016, the population has increased from 14.98 to 15.41. And the last, 2016 to 2017, the population has increased from 15.41 until 15.85. Next, I will present about the economic data. As we can see, the level of the export and imports are US dollar medium. Uh, for the blue color is the export activities and for the purple color is import activities. This is from 1985 until 2006. The Senegal has experienced both trade deficit as well as balance of payment deficit over years. 
based on the estimates from the Central Intelligence Agency's World Factbook, Senegal's export good plus service represent 28.9% of total Senegal's economy output or gross domestic product. Please note that the overall value of export, exported goods and services include a sizable share of re-export. The analysis below focus on exported products only, such as cotton, petroleum products, phosphate, manufacturing goods. The main countries exporting to Senegal is India, Italy, Spain, Mali and France. Okay, let's move to the review of unemployment problem. Okay, the diagram show of the unemployment rate from 2007 until 2017. As we can see, the average of the unemployment rate is in 10.4%, which is the highest percentage of unemployment in Senegal. Okay, let's move to the factor of unemployment. Unemployment affect first and foremost the younger segment of the labor force. While the overall unemployment rate was 10.2%, young women are more negatively affected by unemployment than young men. Unemployment of university graduate is particularly high and has increased to 31% in 2011 compared to the 60% in 2000, 2005. Among the um, among the employed, the total of 32 out of 100 is the difficulty to under employment, meaning they have fewer hours than necessary for survival and seek another job for their fraternity, fraternity and income. Furthermore, the job market for youth is dominated by unskilled labor and the majority of unskilled young people are engaged in agricultural activities. Of the employer youth, 46% are educated and 28 have only received primary schooling. This lack of education and skills creates a major challenge for policymakers in their in inclusion strategies. Otherwise, the projected economic change will exclude the majority of young people, thus fueling social and economic demand that may continue to, to disturb the country. Next, this is a factor of unemployment in Senegal country. What we have found is, first, lack of application, lack of graduate job, and underground economy. Yeah. Okay, for the first factors of unemployment is lack of qualifications. Young people without any skills are much more likely to be unemployed to some extent. The service sector has offered more skilled jobs such as bower, supermarket, checkout and waiters. However, the nature of labor market is that many young people lack the necessary skills and training to impress employers. The second factor of unemployment is lack of graduate jobs. Many young people leave college with a degree, then find graduate jobs are in short supply, some some find they can be overqualified for the job market they enter. And the last thing, underground economy. Official unemployment may occur in areas where there is a thriving black economy. In example, there are unofficial jobs for people to take. And the last one, there is three ways how to overcome unemployment problem in Senegal country. And the first one, Change in industrial technique. Production technique should suit the needs and means of the country. It is essential that labor intensive technology should be encouraged in place of capital intensive technology. And for the second one, on how to overcome an un unemployment problem, is change in education system. Educational pattern should be completely changed. Students who have liking for higher studies should be admitted in college and universities. Emphasis should be given on vocational education. Qualified engineers should not start their own small units. Okay, and the last one, increase in production. To increase employment, 
It is essential to increase production in agriculture and industrial sectors. Development of small and cottage industries should be encouraged. Thank you for watching our videos. I am Muhammad Ilham Ismadi. I am Dedel Hazik. I am Iskandar Zikanai. And I am Muhammad Shadi Ben Rosano. And we are from group Power Power Board. Hmm.